Chicago HR is filmed live with the men and women of human resources. All employees will retain employment unless terminated by a supervisor. For cause. So why did we have to move again? It was just easier to demolish the old office after Frank's retaliatory shit and run. It's that time of year again, when careers are made or broken. Annual reviews. Yeah, boy! Get some! <laughs> pew, pew. And this year, it's our turn. We are judge, jury, and executioner. Faye and Farley were too busy to review management, so uh, they asked us to take care of it. Golf trip? Sexual harassment case. 50-50 shot. Yeah. There's added incentive this year to find ways to cut costs following the company's unexpected relocation. Woods here is deciding who to start with. Oh. What is uh, it, Woods? Uh, uh, is someone stealing coffee again? <clears throat> Watching porn at their desk. Who started the fire? <laughs> I swear to God, if that kid fell down the well again, it's on him. All right, and his parents. Sweet baby Jesus. The Holy Grail. <laughs> oh, I can't fucking wait for this. <laughs> Looks like the tables have turned. Temporarily turned. It's time for your review, my friend. Take it easy, Langston. If you can't handle this work, go take a walk. I can handle Butch Freddie Mercury myself. <sighs> All right, Chief, time to get some things straight. Shouldn't you be out okay, there? Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Shit, Ron Burgundy. I'm in charge. Your hair's getting a little ridiculous. All right. Your delivery of, God damn it, could really use some work. That's perfect. And your daily fitness routines are getting outlandish, sir. Outlandish. Chief, I'm sorry, but your choices of active wear, they... It made me question free the nipple. Could you maybe just turn the heat on in your office or something? My God, you could hang a coat off of those things. Uh, hey. <clears throat> Are you kidding me? You're supposed to be reviewing people on their job performance, <laughs> not their human identities. Chief. Chief, 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 Chief. We're HR. Okay. We don't work directly with any of these people. Please tell me you didn't do anything irreversible. Uh, oh, my God. We, um... We fired Diabetic Dave. Yeah. <sighs> For being diabetic? Oh, God. Oh. He was driving up the cost of the company health plan, Chief. Please, please tell me that's it. Uh, Cross-eyed Karen? <clears throat> <laughs> Productivity was in the toilet, Chief. People couldn't concentrate, and she was haunting. I hate going to court. I hate it so much. Well, then I guess you don't have any interest in seeing these. What? Why is this? Less shouting. Langston and Woods would kill for you. Jesus, where did you even get that? Pick one fitness fad and stick with it. The mm. shit is getting ridiculous. Get a dog? Yes, you could really be the whole package. We could call him Bark Ruffalo. Or Groucho Barks. Not, not bad. Thank you. Wear more shorts? Yes, you have beautiful calves. Flaunt them, Chief. God damn it! No! No! You know better. No. Today wasn't our finest hour, but we're gonna make amends, God damn it! See, that's way better. One pair of indoor aviators for cross-eyed Karen. Great. What do we get in the diabetic? Gotta make a diabetic gift basket. Perfect. Do you, ha you have three of those now. I sure do. You never know when people are gonna come thieving around HR. Give so them. I gotta be prepared. No, Woods, two? Who's in charge? One, one of them. I'm in charge. that way. 
No. I think it might be time for your review. <laughs>